Hi friend, how are you? If you are not subscribe my channel, please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updated real life video and technical video to enhance your knowledge and for enjoyment of your life. Today discussing topic is about relay. It is the heart. It is everything for the substation and for the protection matter is concerned. A protective relay is a device that detects the fault and initiate the operation of the circuit breaker to isolate defective element from the rest of the system. The relay are operated on the principle of electromagnetic attraction or electromagnetic induction. The relay detect abnormal condition in the electrical circuit by constantly measuring the electrical quantities which are different under normal and fault conditions. The electrical quantities which may change under fault conditions are voltage, current, frequency and phase angle. When a short circuit occurred on the line, the current flowing in the line increases to an enormous value. This result in a heavy current flow through the relay coil, causing the relay to operate by closing its contact. This in turn closes the trip coil of the circuit breaker, making the circuit breaker open and isolating the faulty section from the rest of the system. In substation, the relay which are generally used is an overcurrent relay earth fault relay, distance relay, differential relay, Buchholz relay, OSR oil surge relay, etc. Nowadays, we are using numerical type overcurrent earth fault relay, numerical type distance relay, differential relay are being used nowadays. As per my experience is concerned, the SPAJ 140C of ABB MEG relay, Microm P140 is being used for the protection of overcurrent and earth fault. For the distance protection, the Microm P642 type relay are used for the distance protection and uh, for uh, RET, uh, REL670 for ABB make differential relay, Microm, uh, that is the type is Microm uh, P632 and the Buchholz relay are used on the transformers and uh, the coil or the uh, auxiliary relay coil are Mm, attached to the back side of the panel. When any fault arises in the circuit, a relay finally operates to close the trip circuit of the respective circuit breaker. It is called the main tripping relay or master tripping relay. Other subsequent relay are called auxiliary tripping relay. So the master trip relay is 86 relay and this relay is parallelly connected with all others relay over current, earth fault, distance protection, differential protection, OTI, WTI, alarm, tree, PRV, OSR tree and everything is connected to the 86 relay and 86 relay is called the master tripping relay. Here are a pictorial representations of the uh, total protection circuits, how the protection circuit is being operated, uh, we can explain here. If some fault is just occurred in these locations, the fault current is flowing through this path and the uh, city coil, if the fault is uh, happening here, so the enormous current will flow to this path. 
if the primary side of the current is increased the secondary side of the ct current will be increased if the ct current will be increased this relay will be energized and this relay will be energized so that will be uh, the nc contact that nc contact will provide the trip coil dc power and the trip coil will operate and circuit breaker will be uh, opened uh, and the faulty section uh, is out from the bus bar or the healthy section this is the um, total pictorial representation and easy procedure to remember how the relay is operating and how the relay is connected to the city and the, how the relay coil is connected to the trip circuit uh, trip coil circuit so friend if you are interested to show my technical video please subscribe my channel share my video with your friends with your colleagues and everywhere wherever you want to be okay thank you thank you friend thank you for watching my video